Hello YouTube, I am back once again with uh, the long haul, day 23. Come up on daytime here, seems like a little bit of a wandering horde, but in case you missed the last episode, I have some, we did some exploring in the, uh, the wasteland. Just show you real quick here. Okay, so, you know, went uh, took a trip from from our town, you know, decided to have a little mini bike road trip. Took a, came to a crossroads here, uh, you know, went down south and then decided to go all the way down. And we came up on a crossroads. I took a look at the crossroads and, uh, just to see if we can continue any way or the north. And unfortunately we've reached the, the end of this proverbial road, uh, both early and physically. Um, I'm back here, you know, still in the same stream from, um, I streamed this on Twitch for, you know, Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 4 p.m. Central Center Time. I'm joined by a couple people that are a little chatty and, uh, you know, couldn't be more than happy to have them, uh, chatting up, uh, and, uh, if you want to come join me on Twitch, you can, you can have a, uh, you know, you can have the fun moments too. It's like yo, know, wanted to be a fun place, yo. Know. But anyways, I am, you know, I'm traveling out of town here. Or, well, not town. Traveling away from those crossroads. Got the mini bike refilled overnight. Did some mechanical parts uh, wrenching. Just check up on that really quick. I got 23 mechanical parts overnight. Uh, I need mechanical parts for making. Not only a wrench, but also a good wrench, but uh, making a making some garage doors for my base. I just kind of figured, you know, like after Horde Night, you know, since I have the fast mini bike, you know, a faster mini bike, go and take a take a little take a little trip, uh, long distance trip. We'll come back to putting together the main base here in a while, you know. We should be. Like, I'll probably come back probably after after day 24, depending on how this all goes. So, give me a little bit and uh, we'll go hitting up the road that is going east. So, I will let you know once I find something interesting, YouTube. Well, YouTube, we're coming up to... <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, pardon that, YouTube. Uh, coming up on another crossroads here, traveling east, and then uh, we traveled east from the from this intersection here, and then I decided to go south some more. Um, running into... Oh, cool, El Drago. Um, um, he... Uh, I was asking him a question, like, about pets and all that, you know. Uh, you know, we got a passing gas and everything, you know, good little loot location. Uh, I don't know with if we want to hit this up or if we want to keep driving through this, because, like, I already did a crossroads, you know, yesterday's, uh, you know, in-game, at least, yesterday in-game. And, uh, don't mind me just taking care of our zombies here, but, um, I'll leave it up to, uh, El Drago and, and, uh, Nick Cheetah here, uh, can't remember their name right off the bat. <laughs> um, you know, what do you, what do you two think? Should we stop here for, and raid this, or should we just kind of move on? There is a, there is a bunker. It's like, I know that has good loot, but I'm just kind of trying to contemplate. I'm like, do I want to, or... Oh, Ichikita, yeah. <laughs> yeah, um... Um... But what are you guys thinking? Should we just loot this, or just move on? It's like, you know, apologies for you, to you guys on YouTube. It's just like... You know, want them to have a little bit of input. It's like, I'm not saying it's bad for loot, it's just... 
I don't know. Ow. I feel like we still... <laughs> yeah, you're right, El Drago. It's like the, uh, the, the hotel takes such a long time to raid. It's like, uh, um, and it's like, and, uh, and so, there we go. Take care of zombies. Um, I don't know. I think, well, as much as I don't want to, you know, kind of like leave an untouched loot, it's like, I would have stopped for the passing gas here, you know, well, we have stopped, but it's like, yeah, I would have raided the passing gas if had the, if it's the one with the, um, the workbench, but I think we're going to. I think we're gonna kind of move on here, so you know, take out a couple zombies. But I think we should just move on. It's like it's still early in the day, and it's like I would like a little bit more looting for the for the time. Uh, it's like yo, so we're gonna keep moving here, YouTube. So see you a little bit. Well, YouTube. Um, short time after. Um, I decided to go, you know, of course we went south, uh, out of here, you know, just kind of in search of more loot. And, well, I decided to take a turn down a gravel road and, you know, maybe potentially a trader stop here. And, as luck would have it, we have found a forge house. Just break in here really quickly. There we go. Would you look at that? A forge house. I haven't seen one of these in a, a little bit. We'll just clear out the zombies so they can't claim it for themselves. Yeah, I figured I'm like, I was thinking, like, you know, maybe try to find a trader because, you know, because I don't have the trader quest anymore. Oh, we got a zombie stuck up here, but, um, you know, I figured it would be a good, good little idea just to see if there's a trader hiding up here. But, eh. It's like, it's a free forge, so how can I not take it? Let's try to take care of the big boy here. You know what? You've earned your prize of a 762. There. Enjoy. Okay. But yeah, it's like you know, easy little loot. We'll just leave that there. And sounds like someone there's someone else outside, but not too worried about them for the time being. But yeah, I'm like, well, how can I not pass this up for a, for a little loot, because it's like, free forge, even if it's later game, it's like, I will take, I will take a free forge at the end of the day. Um, where, question is, where did, where did the other zombie go? Where's the zombie at? We're playing hide and seek with a zombie, or peekaboo. I don't know... Oh, they might be out on the porch. There you are. Come here. You've been making enough of a ruckus for me right now, so... You may be... You're being evicted out of your house. Get out. No. There you go. Boop. And... Yeah, I just thought I'd show you this uh, fun little looting location YouTube, so... I'm gonna pick up the forge and I'm gonna uh, move on, so... I'll let you know once again once I find something interesting. Okay, YouTube, I've done some more driving. I uh, decided to take a... hit our crossroad, we went up north some more, so... We got Mikey. He wants to have a word with me. Um, you know, he, but, uh, no certain, my third trader in this world is, is close by, so, um, okay. There we go, Bob. Uh, so yeah, I figured we could check out, we could check out trader, uh, trader wrecked here. Uh, so, let's just see. 
Hello, Trader Wrecked. How are you doing? Put away your weapon unless you'd like to die in my store. Okay, whatever, Trader Wrecked. Uh, let's just check out his inventory here. Well, at least sell him uh, that puffer jacket. He can he can have that. Anything you got for me? Anything at all? I'm kind of looking for stuff like maybe mini bike. Uh, no, not mini bike. Um, nail gun or AK-47 stuff. Um, nothing really in that stuff. Check out the trader stash. Oh, you got a full out. You got a flat out AK-47 for twenty-five grand. I don't even. I have nowhere near that amount for for you. Um. Yeah, really not. No, oh, wait, the sniper schematic. I could definitely use that. I'll sell you some beers, buddy. You can have some. You can have some drinks on me. Question is, can we get close enough to have have the uh, have enough? Um, maybe if we let's just see. I'm at eleven fifteen, thirteen fifty. Man, I treat you that good, you know what? You don't even fucking tip me. Hey, now, I don't need to be <laughs> cruel to me. I'm about to buy something from you. I want the sniper rifle schematic because uh, I don't have that yet. Don't let the door hit you on your. Thank way you, Trader Rick. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's just make sure to read this. Don't scrap it. There we go. So yeah, we're just taking a little. You know, decided to check out the trader. So, and we got a sniper rifle schematic as a as a result. So. Gonna get back on the main road because I would keep driving down that gravel path, but it's just gonna link up to another road, and yeah, you know, we want to keep going. So tune in with you once I uh, once again once I find something interesting. Alrighty, YouTube. I've I've been driving for a while. Uh, I came up on this crossroads earlier. I've been doing a lot of driving. Like I literally. After Trader Wrecked, I went driving here, and then I checked out this crossroad. Then I went and made a whole loop around, and I saw the wasteland on this side of the on this side of the uh, the world. So, the radioactive wasteland. So, um, and then ran to this crossroads, and it's like another ostrich hotel and one of the bigger passing gases. So I'm like, I really don't want to head hit that up. It's like I had a bit of deja vu. But we got a we got a bank and. And a passing gas here, so it's like, I'm, and I checked this passing gas earlier. There is not a, there's not a workbench in there. So, yeah, a little, a little disappointing on that I didn't find like a full town, but I think that means like yo, know, one uh, like after this day, we're gonna go, we're gonna go check out uh, we're gonna go back home and do some more base building. It's like I was thinking about going home after day 24. That was if I got a town. Um, there you go. A zombie and yeah. So it shouldn't take too long for me to. Oh, I've broken my club. That's unfortunate. Uh, one second here, zombies. Just let me craft up a new club. I'm gonna clear out the zombies really quick, and we're gonna. I'm gonna push it into nighttime for you guys. Like, uh, I feel the episode's a little lacking in in terms of uh, what we're doing. Like, you know, I didn't want to bore you guys with driving. So, yeah, let me clear out zombies and break into the safe side. I will show you the loot of this and passing gas. Okay. Level 289. I probably should have brought some forged iron for this. But, oh well. Forge Iron would have done. All you had to do is ring the bell. Ow. Oh, it's turning into a slime match. Bye. Um, crawler, hello. How are you doing? Good sir. Level 90. 30 more skill points to spend. 
Who's it? Oh, hello! Were you trying to give me some money? I really appreciate it. There you go. Let's just make sure we do a little perimeter check here. Bam! There you go. Um. All right, let's let's start breaking in here. Really shouldn't take that long. Do 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 do. Mm -hmm -hmm. Yeah, we're already halfway through this. Um, El Drago, when did you, uh, when did you and, uh, and or your wife, uh, pick up the game? I was just a little curious. Oh. Not too much to go now. One last hit on that one. I want to make sure I hit all these up. Doop. Do do do. <laughs> All right. Up. We'll just break into that. Do 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 do. <laughs> Not the most exciting thing bringing into these states, but that's gotta be done. Do, do, do. Ah, okay. Yeah, I picked up the uh, I picked up the game uh, on its launch, uh, basically on its launch uh, for PS4. But it's like uh, I want to say I I know I have now well over 500 hours into the game. Uh, well. It was, Oh, that's cool. I hope I hope she really enjoys it because, like, to me, it's like really like there's no other game like this in my opinion. Like, it's really unique in its aspect. It's like, um, it's uh, I think I remember getting the game on. It was on sale at launch, if I remember correctly, because I remember getting a discount on it. Didn't we all? Didn't we all? Yeah, we all used to hide hide at night. Um, seems like getting a little cold, but nah. Do, do, do. Oh, it's night time. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Mining tools level 59. Man, if we can get our mining tools leveled up, that would be excellent. <laughs> That's awesome. Um. Yeah, it's like for this world, I have some. I have some ideas I want to do for for builds and. Uh, you know, that I would really like to do would be that I think would be a lot of fun. Like uh I originally had the thought to do like uh, some of the older like Call of Duty zombies maps, you know, like kinda recreate them on this version of seven days and then I was thinking to myself, I'm like uh you know, like it wouldn't be a bad idea to do them. Like, you know, I could probably get them done, like get them built, you know, Mostly accurate to their counterparts, but then I was thinking to myself, um, I'm like, really, if you want to kind of have it, kind of do them justice, it would be best to have, best to wait for the new version of the Seven Days for console because they have all, they have the like, well over 300 shapes, like, uh, you can really get the details down, and um, I'm thinking like. And I don't I don't know if I want to do any of those ideas before uh, that version comes out. It's like, um, you know, I'd love to do them, but I'm like, 
kind of was I don't want to exactly sacrifice too much quality in it. It's like yeah, you know, I want I want them to I want to do them justice. So. Um. Okay, you two. I have just broken into all the safes here, and we're gonna raid them. Level 92 shotgun receiver. Not even got bothered from taking that with. Anything below like level 100, like if it's, I'm not even really gonna bother with it. It's just one of those. It's not that great. Sawed off barrel. Like I might as well. Yeah, you I'll know, probably just keep it. You know. Magnum frame I'll take, and we got what's that? Oh, pistol parts. Yeah, no, thank you. And we got. Oh, decent safe in here. Iron Glow schematic and first aid kit schematic. I already know this stuff, but got a hunting rifle with some extra ammunition, so wonderful stuff. Got a sawed off shotgun barrel with shotgun parts. We'll just put together the. put that together. I know it's nighttime and, you know, a little. hitting it a little bit late, but, you know, figured, you know, push it before you guys. On YouTube, yo, why don't you guys have a decent episode? Raid all the two tokens out, and our, our shotgun barrel, AK-47 schematic, and another point of leather working. Oh, well, that's, and then we got a shotgun, a uh, shotgun stock, and got a hunting rifle parts there. Uh, we'll just drop that leather, and then we got a couple more zombies to, to, to well, not zombies, a couple more safes to look at really quick, so take a look in here, gas can schematic, not much, uh, and then, yeah, hunting rifle stock and, and some extra paper, I don't really need it, really not too bad, so. I think we'll, I think we'll raid the, do a quick, a quick little raid on the, on the pass of gas before, before we end it off for the episode, so, I uh, just need to do a little bit of, a little bit of organization here, we'll just take that shotgun, and we'll throw that gasoline in there, throw the stock in, and, um, I thought I had our hunting rifle part. Yes, we do. There we go. Just a little bit of, of condensing in the inventory. Oh, yeah. we put those gun parts together. They save a little bit of space, but it can really help. Um, sounds like we got company. We'll just uh, break in here and we'll at least raid the office. Oh! Two zombies, at least. Mikey, no, please don't. Stop it. Okay. You're done. Yeah, you can see where I took a look see in here, yeah. We'll just break that in. You're done for. We'll just take care of old Curly here. Um oh. We'll try to take these out really quick, so. Damn it, I died. Well, I was not expecting to in the episode like that, guys, but on that bombshell, that, that's, a little, that's a little surprising. So, I hope you have a great day and take care.